Hello YouTube, in this video we are going to connect Bluetooth module HC052 to our Firebird V robot. If we refer the manual, you can see that the pin number 45 and pin number 46 of the extension board module are used for serial 3 that is RXD3 and TXD3. Here is a basic circuit diagram which we are going to use for connection the VCC is connected to 5 volt ground is connected to ground the TX of the Bluetooth module is connected to RX of the Firebird V and RX of the Bluetooth module is connected to TX of the Firebird V robot we are going to build our app using MIT's app inventor so go to this website here is the framework of our app. As you can see, we need four buttons. We need one list picker. We also need a Bluetooth client and various vertical and horizontal arrangements. I am not going into details because there are so many tutorials available for building of the app. Here is the logic. We are selecting the Bluetooth client from the list picker here is the core logic when button 1 is touched down we are sending letter L when it is touched up that is when we release the button it is going to send letter S similarly button 2 will send R button 3 will send F and button 4 will send B I added some pictures for the buttons build the app we have two options we can either go for qr code or we can save the dot apk file to our computer here is our arduino code i made the changes in the dc motor direction control program which we covered in our previous tutorials this is our wide setup loop we are using serial 3 for the communication between firebird v and the bluetooth module also we are using serial 2 for the communication between our PC and the Firebird V robot. The baud rate for the Bluetooth communication is 9600 whereas the baud rate between the communication of PC to Firebird V is 115200. Here is our wide loop. If serial 3 is available that is our Bluetooth data is available. We are reading that data. If the data is F we are moving the robot in forward direction. If the data is B, we are moving the robot in reverse direction. If the data is L, we are turning left. If the data is R, we are turning right. If data is S, we are stopping the robot. Now install the app and test it. Here is a task for you. The mobile's acceleration data is sent to the robot via Bluetooth and the robot is moving accordingly. If you want to know more about this, write it in comments. Thank you for watching. Please like, share and subscribe.